Today is the end of the 10th week of the uh, Eight Flags uh, cogeneration project construction. We consider today to be a kind of a significant milestone in that we're pouring our first major concrete pour, uh, which you can see behind me over here. The slab is going to be roughly uh, about 1,200 or more square feet. It's got significant uh, underpinning with some concrete and steel piles. Uh, we've actually got about uh, 64 concrete piles, 26 steel piles uh, that support the slab. The slab will actually help disperse or distribute the, the load of the uh, turbine and generator. Together, the turbine and generator and the auxiliary equipment is going to weigh about 150 tons. And it gives you some idea what this thing actually has, has to be designed to support. Most uh, commercial industrial construction uses concrete that's rated for uh, 4,000 PSI or pounds per square inch. This is actually 5,000 PSI. There's 188 cubic yards of concrete going in this thing, 12 tons of steel rebar, reinforcing bar that will support it. And it's been kind of a, uh, just a, a welcome day to see because of the challenges that the uh, general contractor C.R. Meyer has had out here on the site. They stayed 10 weeks ago, it was uh, July the 13th. And I'd say from July to today, we've had a tremendous amount of rain above average, uh, more than expected. Uh, also, to complicate things, our, our site condition out here has been worse than anticipated. We were going to be looking at drive-in piles no more than 70 feet, and we've had to go as deep as 80 feet. In addition, we've had to add piles to the mix. So uh, we're very pleased with C.R. Meyer, what they've done to date and what they've had to overcome. The project's coming along really well now. We really expect to see some some things that are above grade because of all the effort so far has been below grade and getting the piles in place. And uh, now that they're there, uh, we still have a little pile driving left to do, but uh, now we should actually see some, some significant uh, above ground construction. Uh, we're pleased, as I said before, and, and thankful that we've got such a good GC out here working with us on the project.